Lily Allen showed off her chic style as she left the Noel Coward Theatre after her performance in 222 A Ghost Story on Wednesday night. The actress and singer, 36, wore a long black coat in a bid to protect herself from the early autumnal evening air. The smile hitmaker grinned as she left through the stage door, wearing the trench coat open at the front with the garment finishing just above her ankles. Lily wore a chocolate brown jumper beneath her coat which she teamed with a black pair of trousers and chunky soled polished boots. She carried a black bag on a gold chain on her arm and held onto her phone. Lily was followed by her West End co-star Jake Wood, 49, who wore cycle gear for his journey home following a successful turn. The former East Enders star, who quit the soap in February this year, sported a bushy beard and wore a black baseball cap and a long pair of monochrome stripy socks. Lily's husband David Arbor, 46, jokingly sent her bad luck flowers for her West End play recently. Taking to Instagram on Thursday following her performance in front of gushing theatre reviewers, Lily shared a note from the Stranger Things actor who remarked that he hoped she wasn't reviewed well as hell be miserable. Alongside a pretty bunch of flowers, he pinned a message which read, My ambitious wife. These are bad luck flowers cause if you get reviewed well in this play, you get all kinds of awards and I will be miserable. The humorous actor signed off with, Your Loving Husband. Highlighting the fact that she had in fact received great reviews for her performance, Lily hilariously captioned her post, Sad Day Fred Carver. Lily's production which opened on August 3, received high praise from critics who applauded the macabre playfulness of the production and her stellar stage presence. The star plays the character Jenny in the thriller about four friends caught up in a night of high tension. She is joined on stage Jake, City of Angels actor Hadley Fraser and Julia Chan of Silent House. The play follows Jenny, who believes her new home is haunted but her husband Sam, Hadley, remains skeptical. They argue with their first dinner guests, old friend Lauren, Julia, and new partner Ben, Jake, and decide to stay awake until 2.22 am to discover the truth, 